Hey guys, John here. Welcome back to NASCAR 06. Alright, so we have truck series qualifying and race and possibly a nationwide race or yeah, nationwide race as well this episode. I'm not sure. We will see how it goes, but let's go ahead and qualify the truck race at California. Okay, let's see what kind of lap we're gonna get here. Really hope we do better than we did at the start of the season with this team. It's not this kind of start that we were hoping for, that's for sure. Whoa, gosh, dang it. Well, it's tight, I can tell you that much. Jeez. I have to carry much less speed into the corner if we're going to make sure we can rotate it. Okay, that didn't help either. Hmm. We might be wanting to tweak this setup a bit. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Alright, let's see if I can do this a little better though. Let's try letting off sooner. Whoa, okay, well. See, there's this weird little thing with this game sometimes. Oh, man. Yeah, we might as well just forget it. I think eight's going to be good enough. <laughs> Uh, there's this weird little thing with this game, uh, and a lot of NASCAR games actually, where if you let off and then get back in the gas, the, the vehicle just goes straight to the apron. It's like, okay, I didn't want to turn that much. Um, it's weird. What's <laughs> our tire pressure looking like? See, we're going to need higher anyway for, um, you know, the tire wear situation. That's going to take away even more handling, so we're going to need to definitely... Go down at least around, I think. We'll see how that works out for us. I don't know. We might regret that, but whatever. We'll figure it out. Okay, I have to finish ahead of all my teammates. Got it. We'll see how that goes. Okay. Made a slight mistake here. Took my hand off the controller and did not get on gas when I wanted to. That's not good. Gosh dang it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay. I had I had my cord wrapped around my hand. It was just never was gonna work, so I needed to fix that. <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna give us a really bad start. Alright, caution is out. Well that'll help us regroup I guess. <laughs> What brought out the caution? Oh, hi. Okay. I had some issues. Uh, no. Way too early. Don't really gain anything from that, I don't think. So we're going to have to make it to like lap 13 before we pit so we can make sure that we make it. Uh, I have a feeling that at least one of our teammates, if not more, are ahead of us now because of that terrible start. So that's not good for that challenge, but whatever, it's fine. Actually, I think that's one of our teammates right there in that uh, Mr. Clean truck. Alright, truck's handling much better in the middle of the corner, at least now, until the tires wear out, but I'm pretty happy with it. I think that was a good choice. Alright, give our teammate a boost there. He's trying to make something happen. Probably shouldn't do that since I have to finish ahead of him. Whoa, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was my bad, I didn't let off. I just drove straight in the corner as hard as I could. That was, that was getting a little too ambitious, I think. off a little early, a little tap of the brake to center it. Just gotta make sure not to get on the apron like we did that one time and we should be alright. It takes a lot of focus to do this. People don't understand sometimes. Like, this is just a game. Imagine the amount of focus you'd need to do this for real going 170 miles an hour into the corners. I mean, holy crap. 
well, more than that, into the corner. That was 170 in the middle of the corner. But, you know what I mean. It takes a lot of concentration to do what these guys do. Yeah, this is working out pretty well. I've got a good feel for the corner now. Setup change helped. We just have to hope that it doesn't get really bad when the tires start to wear, but luckily the higher air pressure means that they won't wear as early. Okay, I I was kind of stuck behind this guy. and It was messing up my arrow and my entry to the corner and stuff, so... Whoa, hi, teammate. So it kind of had an effect on me there. See, and it got turned a little too much there. got on the apron, but you know what? It kind of worked that time. It's dangerous, though, I think. <laughs> Probably shouldn't do that too much. Wow, dude, we're allies, and you're trying to chop me off like that? Chill. Nope, nope, nope. It's amazing how the air coming off these other vehicles can affect you so much. This game was really ahead of its time. They understood how these cars should handle trucks, too. Um, more than these new games they've been coming out with, too. Although I will say that I'm, pro ah, I'm probably going to try out NASCAR 15. Um, I never got NASCAR 14 because I heard such bad things about it. Plus, I didn't want to pay full price for a NASCAR game again. <laughs> after my experiences with the previous few. Um, but NASCAR 15 is basically just going to be a bunch of updates and bug fixes for 14, and it's only going to be $20 when it launches. So it's not like a brand new game, but it's going to fix a bunch of the things that were wrong with 14 and then basically re-release it as a new game. Um, so I can get behind that. I can get behind it only being $19.99. That's cool, and uh, so I'm I'm gonna try out NASCAR 15, see how it goes. Um, we'll probably, if it turns out to be pretty decent, I'll probably live stream it, and then just put those races up on on this channel. Oh God. Um, or maybe my uh, my racing and WWE channel. I don't know. I have no use for that channel right now, so maybe I should put something up on there. But we'll see. But whatever the case, you can look forward to me trying that out in the near future, whenever it releases, I guess. Okay. It's a little skatey, but it's not too bad at all. The tires aren't wearing, so you know what? I might actually go for a two-tire pit stop. And we haven't hit any tire wear at all right now. And... Uh, yeah, we might actually be able to win this race. I mean, we might win the race anyway, but if we have a bad pit stop under green, we're never going to win. So two tires would would make sure that that, uh, that kind of stuff didn't ruin our chances. I'm surprised these guys haven't hit pit road yet. Some other people did. But I'm waiting until 13 will be this next time by in fact you know what let's go ahead and do our pit options just so we don't have to worry about that I'm gonna say let's just do uh, right side tires what the heck why not right all right that all still where it was yeah let's do this let's hope that this uh, is not a really bad decision Let off a little more there, but actually didn't hurt me. Because I feel like he got kind of a bad entry to the corner, too. Alright. He's blocking me hardcore, but it's okay because we're going to the pits. Okay. Spinning out. Not good. I totally blew that. I, I, I thought pit road was closer than it was. Wow, it's a good thing we're getting two tires because I just screwed any chance of us getting an advantage uh, off of that. Dang it, that makes me mad. Wow, 
how did I do that so poorly? First I almost spin it out, then I slow down way too soon. Just misjudged where the entrance pit road was. All these tracks have different entrances, for sure. Alright guys, get out of the way. Make this worthwhile. Alright, we gained probably 7 seconds, I guess. It's usually about 18 seconds, I think. So assuming that nothing had went wrong, like happened in that uh, last race where we had the bad pit pit stop, so yeah. All right, so I'm ahead of this group. I guess that's something. We're not a lap down as of yet. If I can stay ahead of these guys. Well. He just loosened me up somehow there. I'm not sure what happened. That was weird. But now I'm lap down, so we have to hope the caution doesn't come out. That was weird. It's just like he drove up on me, and it's like he did the intimidated thing and got me loose, which I don't think the AI can actually do that to you, can they? That was bizarre. So it looks like we're going to be racing him for the lead. Oh, okay. Once everybody pits, which I don't know why this guy hasn't pitted yet, but whatever. Once everybody pits, um, we might be in the lead. Pretty sure we're racing. Is it John Wood? I think it's John Wood. Can't remember. Or it was into 50 at this point. Okay. Truck's a little squirrely right now. Uh, tires are starting to wear out, the left side tires. But I kind of feel like we should be fine as long as we just can nail our entry to the corner. Oh, he was he hadn't pitted yet? I thought he had. Oh, okay. Well, as long as we beat all these guys off pit road, we should be fine. Like I said, even with that bad entrance, we did shave seven or more seconds off of the pit stop. So... Even if we lost four or five seconds coming onto pit road, we did gain a couple of seconds. In the grand scheme of things. Okay, our teammate... Kevin Harvick in the 92 is leading currently. Got to make sure we finish ahead of all our teammates even if we can't pull off a win. I think we can, honestly. I think we gained quite a bit of time. More than I thought. Yeah, there goes the 50, so... Just have to run nice and smooth, gain as much time as we can while they're getting up to speed. I think we're going to end up with a halfway decent little lead here. Barring incident. Truck's handling pretty good right now. Yeah, I know, left side tires are getting worn. And we just took the lead. We have a one second lead. Okay. We just have to hope nothing goes bad. <laughs> Caution would probably be detrimental. Pretty much. Bad entry to the corner, also detrimental. Dang it. Ugh. I hate when I do that. And of course, tires wearing out more and causing us problems, not going to help. So far, we're, we're maintaining here, we just got to keep doing what we're doing. It's getting a little skatey, I can hear the tires squeal a little bit there, but we're still faster than those guys right now. We just have to not get like real sideways or something and lose chunk of time. Keep it nice and smooth. Make up for that horrible start of the year we had in this series. <laughs> okay, 
Still at nine tenths thereabouts. Mm-hmm. Gained a little bit there. It is, yeah, now my right rear is starting to wear out. I just changed that one a few laps ago, so yeah. Got to be real careful. Four to go. He gained some time on us there. Oh, did you see that? Uh-oh. We were definitely getting, getting real skatey. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, 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 oh. I clipped the apron. I did not mean to get onto the apron. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. This is bad. This is very bad. This is very, very bad. All right. Um, wow. That was, that was bad. <laughs> gosh, dang it. I don't know what we're going to do here. We have to just not let that happen again. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Man, these tires went in a hurry. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, 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 no. Oh, my tires are so shot. Oh, my tires are so shot. Yep, well, there goes that. I thought I could keep him at bay, but no. Well, let's try to salvage a halfway decent finish. Dang it. Two tires came back to bite us anyway because of the way they wore out yeah I can't do anything now yep well that just dang it this isn't good for us a caution is not good for us here because <laughs> I didn't know <laughs> I don't know what to say this is bad this is very bad Oh, that's right. I forgot this game has that where it'll freaking restart you at the start finish line at the checker flag. Whatever. All right. Oh, that was Todd Cleaver, not John Wood. All right. Anyway, well, we salvaged fifth, but that's really depressing. That is very depressing. You know, if I'd known that was going to happen, maybe I should have wrecked the 50 and then I might have still won. Oh, well, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Not going to be a total jerk about stuff. Um,. Dang, that makes me sad. But you know what? It's a top five after a really bad start to the year, so let's just take it. What now? Oh yeah, I did the team challenge. Cool. What? Oh, Tony Stewart wants to do a showdown, huh? Cool. Uh, when's that? here okay well no oh yeah that's it that doesn't look like that's gonna interfere with anything actually as a matter of fact uh that may be that and qualify may be all we get in this episode because i'm not gonna have time to do a 50 lap race after that so yeah let's just go ahead and do the showdown and then maybe squeeze in this qualifying and then that'll be the episode all right, one of these fantasy street course things, which I haven't done in a really long time, so I'm not sure I'm going to remember the track all that well. And what an ugly car they put me in for this. All right, well, let's see if we can't, uh, whoa. <laughs> Holy crap. Wow. Alright guys, so I just went ahead and skipped that because right off the bat I just completely messed up and yeah, there's no sense in showing you me four seconds behind for the rest of the race after I messed up the first corner. So I'm just going to get qualifying done here. 
All right, let's see how we're going to get qualified here. Oh, gosh, dang it. <sighs> I felt like I was entering way too hard. I jumped on the brakes and it just shot me up the track. And now I'm on the apron, which I did not want to be. Okay, cool. Well, this lap's a loss. Uh, let's see what's going to happen this time. If I can get into turn one and two better, we'll be fine, but... I totally messed that up. Nope. Alright, let's just... Oh, I can't restart it. Cool. Thought that was a thing I could do in this game, but apparently not. Well... Looks like we're kind of stuck with this. Man, everything just fell apart. Like... I was so excited about going and doing that showdown, and then that was a total waste. And then I thought, well, at least we can get a good qualifying thing in. And then this has been terrible, too. But at least we're going to get a couple more spots here, I guess. Jeez. I thought for sure that was... I guess it's... Uh, is it Dirt to Daytona that lets you redo qualifying? Or one of the other ones I play. All right. Well, we're just going to have to accept that, I guess. Um, as far as setup goes... We're going to do the usual thing to make our tires last longer, and then I guess we're going to take... Uh, take just a half out. But yeah, that's going to have to do, I guess. Alright guys, so that's going to do it for this episode of NASCAR 06. Um, I know it's a little shorter, but I can't do like the... I mean, if I did this, it would be probably a 55-minute episode or something. And, and the 45-minute episode was a bit much, honestly. So, yeah, we're just going to keep it shorter here. The next time we'll do this and this. And then we'll see how much time we have after that. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Oh, let me actually show you the points, I guess, because we want to see how much we gained in the truck series, right? see where we ended up there we are um 16th so we were like 32nd i think so that's good we've definitely gained some ground there um so who knows maybe we can still pull off a good run there i have to gain a bunch of points but uh but anyway yeah so i'll see you guys next time hammer that like button if you enjoyed share with your friends subscribe if you're new to join the wolf pack and i will see you next time i already said that once whatever bye